Welcome to Hopkinton Coffee Break, your home for current community talk, with Patricia Duart, Darlene Hayes, and Connie Wright. Hi, and welcome to Hopkinton Coffee Break. Look who we have joining our conversation today, Chris McFall of Chef McFall. And if you were lucky enough to get to some of the recent events, you've tasted this great food. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. Oh, Absolutely. we're excited. Hoptoberfest. Yeah. Hoptoberfest was amazing. Yeah. yeah. You had a good time? Yeah, I did. Uh, I, mean, I It was my first time doing a table, so. Oh, I was yeah. Just, what know. they, you know, a big thanks out to the library, the friends of the library. They, um, they netted over $30,000 that wow. event. Wow. That was, crazy. That was a, cr it was a and, wonderful you know, time. So over 300 guests, places like you, you were there, all sorts of beers and yep. whiskeys and samplings. There um, was so much food there. She bought a trip. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Well, what were we talking I was about? Looking that? at those, I Panama. Was like, oh. Panama. Yeah, Panama. Exciting. <laughs> exciting. Well, but, you know, and, and all of your luscious goodies are here, but maybe we should just let's do a little backstory first, a little bit of how, so, you know, because you were telling me a bit, and I want to hear how you got to do this work, how you got you, well, a little bit about your you history. You live in town. I you do. and your wife yeah. live in town. Yep, we moved here six years ago. Mm -hmm. so Great. We love the little the, the space, the the little town feeling. It was always amazing. Uh, I've been a chef for over 20 years, so my background was all restaurants uh, up until about a year and a half ago when um, we had decided that, uh, you know, family time was more important than work time. So, so you have kids? I do. I have a, I have a son who would be five in February. Oh, so starting kindergarten next year? Yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. Big day, you know what yeah. I mean? We're excited because it's such a good school system. You'll be starting those, like, first day of school pictures. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you never think that you'd ever be that person, but I have a feeling. Oh, like trust me. <laughs> we're all that person. Right. It's yeah, the fun of it. <laughs> when you don't have children, you're like, oh. Their car is a mess. How I can know. they live like that? <laughs> and I then know. you're like, oh. You know, yeah. It was funny because you were talking about going from restaurants to private, and I don't know where we were, and I was saying, I wonder why some people pick the things they do. And I said, one of the ones I always think of is like, people can be so passionate about food and everything else and say, I want a restaurant. I'm like, but you work every holiday, you work nights, you work it's true. weekends. Right. You know, every holiday. You get, you, and literally, you get in exhausted off your feet at one in the morning. <laughs> You sleep if until like lucky. 11 and then you're yep. back there ordering food and checking right. stock that's, and going that's on. That's pretty much chef life. That's so I hear your wife was instrumental, we were saying, in having you change careers. She was. She, um, she was, you know, bringing Sam up on his own and uh, because, you know, I'd see him half hour a week. So we just, oh you wow. know, we had a friend, she's a personal chef too, and she was like, hey, put that bug in my, my wife's ear. How about being a personal chef? Wow. Are you friends with um, Sabine? I am. Yes. Wow. Sabine's Sabine my neighbor. Yeah. Stuff like that. We're, eventually, we'll probably have her on the show too. It's she's great. Go, she's awesome. So great. Tell yeah. us about. So you made the leap to be a personal chef. How many years ago? Yeah. When was uh, that? A year and a half ago, we started. Okay. This wow. Business. You just New. started. Yeah. Yeah. Straight out of the the door. So. So <laughs> what like does that. personal chef mean? Yeah. Well, personal chef. Um, for me, it's. Uh, basically, I go to people's houses and, and I personalize their menus for them and I make their meals for the week. So when they come home, they open the refrigerator, mm -hmm. they have everything in there, all nicely organized. You're their personal blue apron. <laughs> so basically, really yeah. Except that it's actually wait, already prepared. Wait, 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 yes, back, up. wait back up, back up. It, yeah, because it sounds so for the rich and famous, but obviously, you know, if you're doing it for lots of people, this is a normal thing. Right? Yeah. Or you is know, it? it's, you know, it's uh, four portions per meal. So, you know, if you have a family of four, or a family of five, it always works out. I'm always a little bit over when I make the portions, yeah, because that's just the way I am. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, it's all personalized. You know, there's instructions on there. You know, everything that you need is in there. Plus, I I do dietary needs. I do all that kind of stuff. Just you know, for people who want to lose weight or they're where were you when I my three children <laughs> right. were at home? I'm so, an empty yeah. nester. It's me the beagle now. Right. <laughs> Back to who does this? I mean, just like, you know, working families? Normal you know, people. Just, yeah, just normal to working to, yeah. people mm -hmm. actually hire me. You know, they're not uber rich. They're not living okay. in million dollar mansions. All right. Uh, but there are normal people that normal just people. don't have, you time. know, they work. Yeah. They both work long days like mm -hmm. I used to. Mm -hmm. And they don't have time to cook for their families and make healthy meals and make right. sure their kids are eating properly. So, so things are frozen or you bring it prepared? No, I, it I bring everything. I shop that morning. I go to their house. I prepare everything and I have it all in there. So when they come so home, you go daily fresh. to their house? No, no, no. That okay. I go once a week. Once so, a week, but you but get it all set up for, for the meals? For five so, meals. So. Okay. okay. But, uh, wow. you know, everything's fresh that morning, so everything will last. Now, That's you did feature some wonderful desserts at the Hoptoberfest, the yep. library um, fundraiser. 
Um, so clearly, you're not making, I mean, you're doing more than just the, the I do. I, party. I do catering. I do dinner parties, which are a favorite of mine because you get to interact with everybody. Um, okay. I also do cooking classes in people's homes, wow. you know. We learned, like I did a dinner, you know, a, a teaching of making gnocchi, a sweet potato <gasps> gnocchi. I wow. love tomato gnocchi. Tomato sauce. Yeah. And, you know, they get to sit down, they eat favorites. it after it, mm. drink some good wine. Yep. You know, it's people <laughs> hanging out, they're having fun. So the interactive dinner parties are fun. I did a couple of those for charity that, you know, and we did them at like um, a, um, a kitchen outfitter out in Westboro. Mm. And um, they... People loved it and stuff like that. It was yeah, great. Yeah, it is. It's it's it, people love it. like they, they love to interact. They love to get their hands dirty. Oh yeah. Oh. You know, and, be and they like to themselves. eat. They yeah, love to yeah. eat. But that's now the most some, most important. Some lucky family has you for Thanksgiving. That's true. Saying. Yep. Yeah. Not your own. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, it's I have most of the most days off. Yeah. So I'm not, you know, it's Thanksgiving. I know I'm not American, and it's not really a big holiday for me. It is important to my my wife and my son. Which they'll spend it with their with our family, but mm -hmm. um, the you know when I'm asked, I have to I have to yeah. go when I'm asked. So yeah. right, you but know, that's that's fun it's good for yeah. business too. You know, yeah. so. well, what a wonderful service. It, yeah. yeah, and they're a great family. They hired me last year too. <laughs> so. So. <laughs> so so back up a little bit because um, uh, the three of us do enjoy cooking, and I think you know, at, yeah. at varying degrees and levels and have different backgrounds. Mm -hmm. And in spite of my Pennsylvania Dutch upbringing, I actually cook things that aren't so bland and aren't all pork and sauerkraut. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's sure. not about that. But, but, <laughs> but so um, what are some of your favorite dishes? What do you like to make? Oh, and, um, and do you like complex things or simple things? Or what are, what are some well, of the things? Well, there's things here, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you want to hear about We're going to get know, into we've those. Been salivating. Well, but I believe <laughs> that simplistic is really good. I think fresh, fresh, simplistic food. Um, I used to live in Italy, so I got that whole flavor of fresh pasta, fresh sauces, and using all the fresh herbs. Um, so for me, I adore cooking Italian food. I, make, I love making salt and boca, mm. marsalas, and puttanescas, and using all the freshest ingredients I can get, so. See uh, Darlene's song now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're Italian. So, the, um, so you do, like, uh, dinner parties and things like that. So what will be on your menu for that family you're doing for Thanksgiving, going into the holidays and the season? Well, they're, they're very traditional. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I researched because I know the original Thanksgiving was lobster. They're not eating lobster, yeah. they're having a turkey. <laughs> yeah. um, so it's a brine turkey with mm. all the trimmings. You get the green beans, the gravy, mm -hmm. but I'll, I'll arrive in the morning, pop the turkey in, and then all day I'm just cooking. Yeah. So there's nothing, I don't buy anything right. pre-made. Pre I'm making no, the stuffing from it. scratch. Yeah. Right. So they wow. get the, but they get to see all this too. So then when they sit down, they know they're eating something that's going to to be delicious. So right. they had the smells in their home oh, yeah. all day. Oh. That's the brining thing, yeah. too just holds in the juices. Oh yeah, it's amazing. It, it, it just makes that turkey so, so much how more. Do you what do you use? We do yeah. like a big five-gallon bucket. What's your brine? What's your brine? What do you I use uh, pickling spice, chicken stock. I had threw in some white wine, and then I threw in about half a gallon of honey. Honey. Wow. Yeah. That's oh honey. my word. Now honey I don't brine. think I've ever heard that. So yeah. are you doing honey salt? Is salt in there too? Or yeah, but I salt the bird. Okay. You salt. You salt the bird first. Do you salt the bird? Before you brine, yeah, or I, after? I you, you can. What you do is you take a little bit of salt and a little bit of uh, water. And you mix you, that oh, together yeah, until it's a paste, and, and then you okay. and then you smear it over the turkey, and okay. you let it sit like that for a little bit. You so also take the. It also helps to crisp the, the skin, skin on the outside, which is my the favorite tip. part. Yeah. Oh my god! Yeah, it's, it's basically part. bacon too. <laughs> right, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and then you let that sit for two to three hours, and you take it out and you drop it into the brine, and then you brine it. I always brine mine for three days. Okay. okay. Just so yeah. you get that that flavor yeah. into the wow. into That's the turkey. That's what we do at our house yeah. too. And then take it out and roast it. Yeah, I can hear recipes got all me thinking, day. This year's my brother's turn to to we rotate, and so everybody has what they do. But then when it's at your house, you also do the bird do and the bird. and the the um, stuffing and and gravy and potatoes. Yep. But um, yeah. we always have such a a herd that like. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I add extra turkey, and sometimes he adds extra turkey. So and we have to throw in do a small the, bird. And yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Thinking. Oh. Thinking. Yeah. Well, we throw the, in the soul food element, you know, with oh. the collard greens, and oh, yeah. we do a really rich mac and cheese that, um, and oyster dressing. That's, <gasps> like, that's a local New England so, thing, too. But. It's all super healthy. 
Yeah. So oh, well, you know, good night. Dressing. We use turkey, um, yeah. smoked turkey for, for green salad. Oh, nice. Yeah. I like the smoked turkey. So for mm -hmm. like this time of year, what are the fresh produce and things that are kind of in? Well, uh, it's all going to be root vegetables and, you know, mm -hmm. butternut squash. There's a acorn squash is perfect this time of the year. I, I take that and I cut it in half, yeah. roast it, and then I stuff it. Oh. Sausage meat and some cheese oh, in there, that sour awesome. cream. And, you said butternut nuts. squash you do? Uh, no, an acorn, acorn, acorn squash. Yeah. 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 So, so you do that as individual flavor. portions? Or yeah, I cut I it might right be doing that yeah. this year, too. You could sit there and just eat it with a spoon. Sausage? Right. Yeah, Italian, sweet Italian just sausage. Sausage. Cheese. I what use, kind of cheese? I use cream uh, cheese, like a mascarpone. Oh, like a oh, so uh, it's, it's, it's a little sweet. It's, it's not super healthy. No, no, no. Right. Oh, no, no. Phenomenal no. flavor. Yeah. So the mascarpone, and and then there was something else, sausage. You can hire yeah. him to make it for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then you'll have some celery in there, some onions that you sure. saute. So all with all the together. sausage, because you, you let that cool down. Then you add the mascarpone, uh, some sour cream, some parmesan, and then you top that with some uh, roasted almonds. Uh, diced pepper. Oh, and then you I can do this. Yeah. I can do this. Oh, definitely. I think about <laughs> um, it. That's um, a really roasted dish. cauliflower I'm thing. Not today, but you know, for. Oh, so the, um, I've got one actually. <laughs> oh no. More about so. What would be seasonals for desserts? Yeah, desserts. pumpkin, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Well, pumpkin's a huge thing over here. Like in Europe, we don't really get pumpkins. Uh, for mm. Halloween, we take turnips and cut the eyes out. No way! Oh, wow. we do. That's yeah. a so riot. So for me, um, pumpkin pumpkin spice cake. Mm -hmm. uh, I used to make this one in the restaurant. We served it with like a French vanilla bean ice cream, oh. caramel sauce. That thing, like, I, it piles on the pounds. I know I've eaten <laughs> a lot of them, but phenomenal. I love I love the pumpkin spice cakes. Yeah. The, mm -hmm. the pumpkin pie, I'm not a fan. Oh, okay. It's it's definitely um, it's definitely an American thing, but um, oh, you got to try mine with whiskey in it. Oh well, <laughs> <laughs> it's my grandmother's times. whiskey, yeah. and it's got whiskey. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's talk about what these delicacies yeah. are. Well, Not just to, to, to I thought you know I go with um, like little pl uh, party sort of snacks that everybody can make themselves. Mm. Um, so, so yes, yeah, so that's what we got here. Mm -hmm. So basically, We're gonna this try is um, a little crostini with um, some nice herb brie, a uh, royal fig compote. Ooh. And some slices of fresh pear. Nice. So, love. and then we have this nice and simple. Looks great. People love it because mm -hmm. they can just pick it up and go. Small bites. Yeah, small bites. Fresh basil, basil pesto, top of the cheese, yeah, which is that, those little it. small yeah. mozzarellas, which are awesome. Oh, right. This one is this is like a a sandwich. It's it's a BLT. <laughs> You've basically got the bread, the bacon, the lettuce, the tomato, but then I use a spiced cranberry mayo <gasps> on it just to give that a little bit of yeah. extra flavor. And, you know, people love that. They can just pick it up and they can That's go. like the football exactly. snack on Thanksgiving. Yeah. That would be great. Uh, yeah. you know? it's like, or the brunch do you have snack? to cut out these little uh, oh, discs yeah, yeah. of bread yeah. for yeah. toast you, you or whatever? toast them, then you cut them all out. Mm -hmm. You know, you can, I use like a, a Arnold's whole He's wheat just wonder sort of break. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Right. So yeah. something that's got mm -hmm. a little bit of, um, a bit of texture to it when you're biting into it, so. Lovely. I'm gonna try one. Go I'm for it, you guys. This I morning. know. So yeah. I'm, I'm trying the crostini well, we'll with I'm gonna try one thing at a time. We'll try yep. this too. You're gonna, I'm gonna try oh, this. Oh, okay. I'll hold the plate, you guys eat. Okay. Oh, yeah. This is delicious. So mm. very simple, very easy. Oh, this easy. is really good. Um, very lovely. And as I said, they're they're not messy, which mm. you know mm -hmm. a lot of people have their parties at their houses. Right. Mm -hmm. You don't want messy. You right. want nice, safe, clean carpet. Exactly. <laughs> Couch. So, but these these are awesome. So you were raised in Ireland. Yep. You lived in Italy. You were educated in UK. Yep. How'd you end up here? <laughs> it was funny. I was uh, walking to up all places. Right, right, right. Well, I, lived, walking. Walking. I lived in I lived in Somerville for a long time too. So, um, I've been here ten years. So I was walking down the street in Ireland, in Northern Ireland, in Belfast, and there was a huge American flag. Now we here. Now, now we here. Right? Right? <laughs> talking about home. You're not Irish. And now you're Irish. I love it. It, it I does. Love it, it comes out a little bit. When you're talking about um, it, for sure. So the big American flag in the window. And they were um, sending people to America to, you know, to work and ten years ago and to learn. with the big yeah. tech. Oh right, and yeah. yeah. Lot going on. It was a huge visa. It was all these three governments together, and they shipped you over and they made you work. Shipped you over. Shipped you over. Oh yeah. yeah. Shipped you over. The next I mean, day you're. So just remember those days. That's mm -hmm. how it worked. And um, well, that's when I, you know, I got a job in Somerville working as a sous chef, and I met my wife, mm -hmm. and I had only a two-year visa, so uh, we ended up, you know, we were in love, so. Well, you, you, you have to stay together. <laughs> I know. It was either move to Ireland or stay here, and right. I was 
you know, him and on about it, but um, <laughs> it worked out for the best. You know, I, I bought my first home over here. I own my own business. I have a beautiful yeah. baby boy. Uh, my wife's beautiful. You know, she's yeah. she's stunning. She's yeah. awesome. So I, Great she's, friends she's on the, the page. Boss, so. She's the boss. Lisa. She's the yeah. boss. Well, so I know I, people can get a hold of you through your website, which yep. is chefmcfall.com, and we're going to have that up there, and mm -hmm. um, we'll get some pictures of some of the food and things like that up on the show. Um, you have a Facebook page. I do. You also have um, an e-newsletter that I've signed up for. Good. So that if there's specials and things like that. and We're sending one out today. Awesome. So oh, all great. Good. You'll get so that. So you guys can also, if you go to Chef McFall's website, you can sign up for his e-newsletter. If you do it soon, you'll get one soon. Um, <laughs> but I think there, there's probably seasonal ideas, specials, things that you've got there going is. on. I'm going to talk today, we're going to talk about turkey. Mm -hmm. Because turkey yeah. is the biggest, the, the most now. important over the next two months. Mm -hmm. yeah. Everybody eats turkey, you know. So we're going to talk about brining. And we're going to talk about recipes and, and mm -hmm. how to cook it. Because so, mm -hmm. oh. you should always leave your turkey for a half hour after you cook it. So I agree. So the a juices go okay. through the breast again. Because yeah. if you cut it right away, the juice just goes everywhere. Out. You so won't it, it be cold yes. if you let it sit? No. How do you keep no, it no, covered? No, no, keep no. it covered in foil. Keep it, yeah. keep it covered, though. Yeah, you oh, can okay. keep it covered. But the bones in it is going to keep the heat. Yeah. So it doesn't chill down very quickly. Mm. Yeah. You'll get that juiciness right back awesome. into the breast. It's yeah. like all meat. You need to let it rest when yep. you pull it yep. out. I don't know that I do a half hour, but I definitely do like 10, 15 minutes. So you say half hour. Well, if you cut the steak after it comes off the grill. You can yeah. lose all the, the, the blood. Just yeah, yeah it, you're the blood. You're all the rareness. Yeah. Me, I'm a I like a rare. medium well kind of guy. So <laughs> I'm Irish. Oh, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm blue. Oh, I want my oh. steaks blue. What is that? Blue? What do you mean? Blue. Oh, it's, I do it's too. Like it's a Pittsburgh very, style. very, very yeah. rare. So yeah, it's really blue. charred on the outside. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's and how I eat it too. And the steak tartare in the middle. Oh, yeah. But that, but I, it's I've cold in the middle. A, a yeah, I like it that way. Like, yeah. like <laughs> barely, barely warm. <laughs> barely but then if you have a sauce on the side, you dip it in the sauce. You yeah. don't realize it's it's cold in the middle. Yeah. Yeah. And I do that. Yeah. It's kind of funny. This week up on like our Facebook page for the Royal Housewives and on my own, I put up a thing I'm like, not shy. knowing yeah. that Chef McCall is coming, <laughs> coming yes. on. Thinking dinner parties. Thinking dinner parties, thinking holidays. If you had a dream dinner party, and you could fight two guests, one male, one female, dead or alive, who would you get? And we really got a wide assortment yeah. of people from Jesus to Queen Elizabeth to, to their own past grandmothers. Right. I mean, mm. most popular was probably Catherine Hepburn and Queen Elizabeth. Mm. But, really? uh, Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Queen Elizabeth. But if, Queen but Elizabeth. if you had a, a, yes. like an all star. Um, have, you got, have you done some celebrity? What would you um, do? I've never. I've never really cooked for celebrities um, but if I had a chance to, to meet somebody I'd love to meet Gordon Ramsay well, I want to see one. exactly oh. if he's really like that or oh. if he's not because mm -hmm. is it just for TV right you know, is he just trying to grab I've these? met Bobby Flay oh cool I've watched a few of his shows he's he is a pretty talented guy can you beat Bobby Flay though no <laughs> <laughs> He cheats. He's got all these helpers. Oh, yeah, running after him. Yeah, yeah him you know, I'm like, sorry, Bobby Flay, but uh, you don't <laughs> really cheat, but, you know, I and advantage, yeah. you have an advantage. And I, I think the neat thing with the, this list that came out was it wasn't all celebrities. One person wanted to bring her husband, things like that. Mm -hmm. things like, but it was also a very wide assortment of people who are dead or alive, but yep. from musicians to comedians to, you know, people who are actors to politicians mm. bill and hillary were going to be at the dinner party <laughs> you know trump didn't make the list no at all or bernie for that matter bernie didn't make the list <laughs> jeb didn't make the list but hillary made it bill and it. hillary made it mm. you know and some kind of made me sad like robin williams made it and it's like i yeah. can't even watch his movies now you know it's like especially i can't even look back at dead poets society knowing how yeah. that whole ended and stuff yeah but, which know, shows the, the diverse interests of uh, the women on the page in terms of the variety of different guests richard branson was one yeah. you, you know I, I'm going to interrupt. If you guys haven't had the... <laughs> okay, I'm driving in. The BLT. Ba BLT. Oh, my God. <coughs> so oh, we should have a napkin. Sorry. Spiced mm. cranberry mayo. Oh, my goodness. And you make that yourself, too? Mm. I make a lot of little uh, jellies and compotes. Mm. Yeah, like, mm. great. I like, you know, my favorite meal is a nice piece of toast with, like, fresh jam on it. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I'm, I'm very... That's my grandmother brought me up like that. That's simple, the way I like huh? Eat it, so mm. so I, I will tell you that this is yummy. in the winter. Mm. Don't ask me why. I do it in the winter, not the summer. Um, I make like batards and and you know I have the Bouchon Bakery and I'll do a poolish and wow. like do these breads that take two days to make. <laughs> and there's nothing better than when you pull it out of the oven and it's just. 
crisp on the outside, soft in the middle, and of course I probably put on 10 pounds in the winter time because I'm, you know, butter and my favorite jam or compote. Yeah, and you know, it's great winter food. Comfort food is the, the, the only way to great. go in the winter because, mm -hmm. you know, Look at our last winter. And oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Bite your tongue. Inches, <laughs> yeah, snow I ate my way through it. House, so. Mm -hmm. so now, when you talk comfort food versus like what you can do, you know, spring and summer and fall, we have all the farmers markets and things like that. Yeah. Where then do you, head right. out, do you use those really three good. seasons? And then I, do you have favorite markets? Markets? Um, I've, you know, I go to the farmers market, you know, just for me personally, but right. it's only once a week. You can't really rely on that for clients. No. Um, right. And then there's a lot of uh, rules and regulations about using certain places. So, oh, you okay. know, you gotta, as a caterer, you gotta, yeah, you got to follow. As a the personal rules. chef, yeah. so oh, you have well, a commercial yeah. kitchen and all. Yeah, you have to have really? a licensed kitchen. You oh. can't use your own. Okay. So there's, it's it's huge, but I can cook in people's homes. Right. Oh, okay. Without an issue. As long as I'm cooking there, not my then own. Then you're fine. Brilliant. It's all covered, so. Right. And that's so how do I you do bring your own gear, or do you kind of look at what they His have? Own knives. <laughs> and, and you always carry your, your own knives. You'd be surprised. I bought, I bought this three-tier toolkit, and it, it opens up, and it carries everything. I have more spices and herbs in there, and knives <laughs> All and your tools. stuff. So it's oh. yeah, oh yeah. very similar as I'm an event planner, and oh. I have a three-tool toolkit, just a plastic bucket black and yep. decker well, pulls mm -hmm. up the cart rolls one will have like glue sticks I'm and i think joelle and, and her I, makeup kit and, yeah. and, and everybody's got their dragon and i can hold that thing in yeah and so i have an event need. tomorrow night and it will what, be coming in with me awesome. what's your favorite spice or, or what if you had mm -hmm. to like couldn't <laughs> live without is there a one single couldn't live without black pepper oh yeah really yeah black wow. pepper makes or everything, everything. Taste good. Right. salt so, Salt, salt is good, but you know. So I've, I've, I've got, got this girl. mix yeah. because it's a tough one. I thinking I I like chipotle, the the smoke. Yep. Jalapeno, yep. and then I like allspice. Mm. Allspice is very versatile. You can I use that for Sweet, coffee duck and stuff. Uh, savory. Yep. Mm. You know. If it was a fresh herb, I couldn't live without cilantro. Oh, I love, yeah, see, I love cilantro. I love cilantro. I love cilantro. And then I've been meeting a couple people kind of who actually scary. have. I, I like, love it that actually have choking issues on it and like actually allergy issues. Oh, but wow. if regular parsley, they don't. But then there's basil. I don't know. If, I, I, see, basil, I, I, basil. So I, many good ones. Sage. <laughs> you know, I, love. I just discovered I a smoked paprika that I'm using that yes. is yep. amazing flavor. It's And you open it, you know, when you it's smell it. It's got this aroma it. comes oh. off. I use that yeah. too. Like mm -hmm. if, if you were making a recipe and it said add paprika, you should add smoked paprika. Smoked yeah. paprika. It's going to give you a lot more yeah. flavor. And for a, a fresh herb, I think for me is rosemary. You oh, like that, oh, I love, I love yeah. the smell of it. Rosemary right. and chives and stuff like that, and, and because they Time, keep coming up yeah. every year, it's yep. like you plant it, it. The chives just kind of take over on their That's own. That's what goes on the roasted cauliflower I'm going to make. It's um, nice. you know, uh, rosemary and thyme is the herb, and um, you know, mixture of olive oil, uh, olives, capers, yep. and you're pouring this marinade over, you know, blanched cauliflower and roasting in the oven. Sounds delicious. I know. Thought on the internet. <laughs> 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 I know, right? I know. We can get, get, get a repertoire. Yeah, send yeah. me the recipe. I will. Yeah. I will. Love it. Yeah. Well, so I am also a big fan of balsamic vinegar, and I love mm. reducing it. And I'm like, the, and I do like a, a berry compote with yep. a balsamic reduction, and then again, I'm one of those bad people. I can't leave well enough alone, and just. Tiny little bit of chipotle pepper on top. <laughs> you like everything spicy, huh? <laughs> not, everything, not everything, but I like mixing savory with sweet. Yeah, and, and well, I think it, 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 it hits all your taste buds, so you're hitting everything at the one time, and that's what makes you happy in your brain. It's it's yeah. a, like a, it's chemically induced. No. So there's been some spices and things like that that I've said have actually have very very good health benefits i think tamarack is one things like that yep. yeah dark chocolate oh <laughs> dark, dark chocolate is good so yeah um, my husband's a very huge fan of mole sauces i'm not but oh, he loves yeah, mole that's sauces. what i gotta do tonight mm -hmm. i need to make a mole sauce <laughs> oh this is gonna be wild and crazy in a chili I mean, in a stuff, chili squash, with the, oh, okay with collard greens oh this is gonna and be you quite have to get into boston for a board meeting okay. i don't know we don't have enough time I did, to cook. I did a chocolate mole for valentine's day last year oh so it was an interesting i lived in cake. northern california for 22 years and i have to say unfortunately the mexican food out here it's hard to find really good and i make my own tamales and i nice. do a homemade mole i have the masa i have the corn husk but you know i could talk about food all day yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.